And hello, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and welcome to Tiger Tales Gaming Plays Um Jamalami. I'm your host, TK, and I will be taking you through this merry collection of colours and bright lights and noises that you are about to experience in this jumbled collection of what we like to call a game. This is the second video of the little series that we'll be doing of about seven videos or so. If you've missed the first video, check back in our archives and look it up. I might even put an annotation on the screen if I remember. But yes, this is stage two of Amjamalami. We have just played the training level with Chop Chop Master Onion, who is now in the process of setting up the rest of the game. If you've ever played Parappa the Rapper, you'll remember that the whole theme of the game was Parappa learning to believe in himself so he could overcome all the problems that the game threw in his way. Amjo Malami is basically the guitar version of that. She lacks self-confidence, but she's really cool when she's playing guitar. So this whole game teaches her that she's got nothing to lose. Just think, it's all in the mind. Your confidence comes from your mind. Your confidence comes from your guitar. So your guitar should be in your mind. Haha. -ha. And now we're setting up the story. The story basically being that Lavi and Milk and her band have a gig tonight. In 15 minutes, in fact. And she's just woken up. She doesn't leave things to the last minute at all, does she? No! Then again, we're all like that kind of, aren't we? So I can't really complain. Let's turn off all of the things! Yeah. Especially the iron. That shouldn't be burning. The bath and... Hoover and click, 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 click. Basically, this is me every time I leave to go to work or somewhere important. So I can completely sympathise with Lavi in this video. But yes, she's got to go do her gig. She's got 15 minutes. Plenty of time, right? Wrong. Because this game is now going to throw up many, many obstacles to block her path and slow her down. Now, if you remember the lyrics in the first stage, Chop Chop Master Onion predicted all of the events of the game so the first stage was a fire or well, we're not allowed to retire according to his lyrics so to try and help out and cut down on the time she'll be spent cordoned off behind the police line even though it's the fire brigade there but you know but let's not draw attention to this chief puddle the lead fireman demands that she helps to put out the fire because, you know, that's how things work, right? We get the little mental pep talk. And then the stage can begin. And I'm going to warn you, I used to be really good at this game. That was a long time ago. Don't forget, this game came out in 1999. And for me, this was a day one purchase. I'm a lot older now. And I suck. I was practicing on this game before doing this recording, and the failure rate was a lot higher than the pass rate, shall we say. So hopefully I will pass first time for this video. I can't promise anything though. I found that during this playthroughs, that there's a little bit of lag between the PlayStation 3 and either me or the game or something. And instead of pressing on like you're supposed to, and which I'm doing really badly there, You've actually got to press very slightly before to compensate for the lag. And that seems to get better results, but I'm not doing that right now. But shush! Stop mocking my bad gameplay! Don't judge me. It's been a while. You'll notice though that as I'm doing worse and worse and worse, and hopefully I can improve, but the actual audio is changing in the background. The music is. When you're in this awful stage, most of the band is gone. You've got just a kind of... I call it the duck track. There's kind of quacking noise in the background. Just to help you keep on beat. And then as you start improving, the instruments and backing vocals start coming back and filling out until you get back up to cool, where everything... I'm oh, sorry, get back up to good, where everything comes back. If you get up to cool, then the vocalist will leave you and you're free to just mash buttons and improvise to a completely instrumental version of the song. And if you hack apart the PlayStation 1 game on your PC and have a look and listen to all the audio files, you'll see that the 
each stage has its own file, and all four versions of the instrumental track, both the awful duck track, the bad duck track, the regular good track, and the instrumental cool track, are all contained within one file, and the game seamlessly switches between the streams as you play, which I thought was quite awesome. And now I'm just going to be quiet while I just concentrate on this bit, and yeah, back up to good. Check me out. I am awesome. It's awesome thing. And now if I'm really lucky, I'll stay good for the rest of the song. That's not going to happen though, is it? It's going to... Oh, maybe it will. Yeah. When I used to play this game a lot, I used to play with my next door neighbour. And this was one of the stages I used to play to death. And I'd be getting up to cool after the second line. In all my recent playthroughs while I was practicing for these videos, I have not yet managed to achieve cool at all. Some of the stages I have already, and you'll see that in the next videos, as I select the stages, you'll see they've got little stars above the level number. And that means you've completed the level on cool. But as you can see, near the end of the song, as long as I pass this bit, I can't fail. Yep, can't fail. The reason you can't fail on the last section of the stage is you need two bad lines in a row to drop a level. So, with only two, level, two lines left, if you do one good, you can do the other one badly and still pass. Okay, gotta move on. Which brings us to the end of stage two. Stage three is... Uh, how could I politely describe it? Crazy, that's a word. And it's another style of music to enjoy as well. Each stage does have its own style of music, which is nice. But we'll let that come into its own in the next episode. So join me, won't you? Because, you know, crazy. Goodbye, everybody. Bye-bye.